What is up guys, it's me Revolving Gamer here and I will be doing I will show you guys how to mod the Samsung Prevail. And um I just had it recently, like just now, factory reset it. So um whoops, no. So let's get started here, shall we? Let's clean my deck off. We will be doing simple test. I will be showing you how I modded my phone previously. And the uh, tools you will need is exposed. Here, let me go to settings. touches and um we need exposed and um i haven't installed mine so i'm gonna show you what to do modules okay there's where okay i will be right back so we are back here at the home screen and um framework what you're going to do is you're going to want to uh, make sure that this line right here isn't red no more you have to click install and update when you first enter the exposed app do not click install only install uninstall if you want to like unroot your phone and then go to framework or no sorry modules I have so far you can find the modules in the Play Store or online I have status bar volume and extensa and I will download more so I will um, uh, Yeah. Oops, not bad. Okay. So right now what we're going to do is get a status bar theme, dimension editor, mm. oh, what is this, this kind of seems, okay, yeah. That's what I had the first time. And go back, modules, check it, download, look for something else that you want, status bar volume, sure, yep, that's what I, already, I got. They have three dot menu, 40 TV, HDMI, KK, uh, GPS, uh, these are all for Lollipop, that's for Max Lock. This is for basically all the, uh, oh. Advanced power menu. That's for um, like when you hold your power button down like that, you'll have more options to like screen record and whatever. These are all options that I've had on my last update before I factory reset my phone. So what you're gonna do then again is you're gonna go to modules, activate that, and look for something else. Basically look for things that you think are capable of your device holding. Everything that I'm using on this Samsung Galaxy Prevail Core Prime 4.4.4 is capable. 
and I will put the um, links in the description below so that'll be easy and then the battery shutdown manager boot manager and then bouncy box is basically a, another busy box sort of I don't use it because it slows down my device And um, basically, in a Chrome, new tab is unlimited tabs for um, Google Chrome. That also slows down your device. Well, we're going to go ahead and... Um, Uh, let's see what we have here. Okay, we're gonna go ahead and uh, restart the phone. Go to download. I have got one more. Um, if I can find it, it's not it. Uh, gravity box cat. Okay, there it is. What you're gonna wanna do is get gravity box and um install. I've done this about a million times to my phone. So then what you wanna do is go to modules again. Oh Go to downloads, go to framework, and I will be right back when it's all installed. What is it guys, we are back here, and um, as you can tell by the status bar, oops, it's, it's a lollipop, it looks like a lollipop, so, but we're going to make it official and actually make it look fully lollipop. So what we're going to do is we're going to go to gravity box. Okay, got it. We're going to go to status bar tweaks. Status bar colors. On. Status bar. Let's go. Uh-huh. That's pretty cool, huh? We'll go to... Do that. New purple. My scene is originally like that. Then we do signal cluster settings, use lollipop icons. And um this is basically all up to you. And then notification drawer. That's all up to you. But I'm going to show you what I do with my stuff. Clock settings. Hack. Oh, no. Um. Progress bar. Enabled. Basically, it's like a... Um. I guess it's for downloads. And then this is um battery, battery bar, show battery bar. That's for 
I don't know if you've seen it at the top, but pay attention and it goes over. And you can either see it or you don't. And it's, you can make it centered or you can make it animation charging. That's what I'm doing. That's what I've always done. Low battery cover will be dynamic cover. Low battery is. Charging battery. And, um, I don't make mine, mine, uh, centered because it's just, uh, I don't know, I just don't want to. And you can move it on the bottom edge. Or you can do it on top, but it don't really work on the bottom. It works more on the top. So, there's that. You show percent. Normal. Larger, if you want. Smaller, if you want. I don't want to show mine. Because I got something better. Battery indicator. You can do, that's what I do, but with the percent. Oh, crap. And then there's that. Yeah. Quick settings management. Tile specific settings. Quick app tile. That. Ah. No, I'll mess with that a little bit later. That takes about an hour to do. Quick pull down, right? So basically, it's like this. Oh crap. Well, that don't really work, so it's useless. Because it does it either way. Notification heads up. On. Uh, so, one finger expands. So, if you like drag it down, and then some like drag it. Uh, notification. You will be able to actually see the actual notification and the text inside of it. And uh, let's see what else. Progress bar. Like I said, that's like uh, when it's downloading something or something. So let's do this. Let's say I want to download an app. It's pretty cool. My Google Play is slow on this phone. Oh, let's just re-download. Uh-oh. Yeah, my phone's acting slow. So in that case, I'm gonna turn the Wi-Fi off. Turn that on. It usually will start acting slow. Sorry about that. <laughs> okay, so now you go to Play Store. Get tested out. 
I say I want to do on the cheese game. Down a bit. Ah, it's not working. Okay, let's check that. Okay, so see that goes. I don't know if you see it or not, but at the very top, where it, I gotta do bottom. Oh no. Well, you get the point. It's basically um, when you get Bluetooth or whatever, you can see it actually uploading. And then tap to sleep. You basically tap it twice and it goes to sleep. I can't show you or otherwise the recording would stop. And um, enable brightness control. You slide it. You can slide it. And it will um, control the brightness. And the application screen recording. This I can't really mess with right now because I'm in a screen recording, so I'll just leave that to you guys. But for now, that's as far as this is much. Oh, what's wrong with this? Hold on a second. Oh yeah, there's the, uh, apparently this isn't working. There it goes. Yeah, you gotta, uh, okay, so, add, you can basically do, add a flashlight. And then a flashlight will be added. You can add screen record. I don't really work this this well, but yeah. Screen record will be there. Then you can uh, devices locked. You can add that. And when the device is locked, it will show that. And um. Toggle Wi Fi. Wi Fi, right there. So, yeah, there's that. Alright, guys. That's my, um, I, I'm, I gotta figure out why this is. I got it. Set as far, set as colors. And, um, and you could, you could do Kit Kat or Jelly Bean. And, um, you can change the icons. There's that. Okay. Well, that's my horn being modded, guys. Um, please leave a like and subscribe if you enjoyed this video. If you want more mods for the Galaxy Prevail, I will be more than happy to give you mods. And I will be looking for mods and updates for this phone and how to root this phone. You gotta do King Root. I am currently rooted. And, um, yeah. Obviously. <laughs> so, please like and subscribe and, uh, bye!